Sharing files is a really important feature in Google Drive. When you share a file with someone else, it makes it easier to cooperate on the document. Rather than sending different versions of the document back and forth through email, everyone can work on the document at once. To share a file from your Google Drive, just select it, then click the Share button near the upper right. A dialog box will appear, and from here, you can start entering the email addresses of the people you want to share it with. If you're sharing with multiple people, just press Enter after each one. You can also decide how much control these people will have over the document. For example, you can give them full permission to edit and change the document, only leave comments, or just view the document. In this example, I want everyone to be able to edit the document, so I'm going to leave this setting alone. It's also important to note that anyone you share it with this way will require their own Google account to view or edit the file. Next. We'll include a short message to let everyone know what the file is about. Then, click Send. Another way to share files is with a link. You'll start the same way by selecting the file, and then clicking the Share button. When the dialog box appears, click where it says Change to anyone with the link. Just like with the other method, you'll be able to decide how much control these people will have. You can then copy and paste the link to share it with anyone, even if they don't have a Google account. In this example, I'm pasting it into an email message to quickly share the file. I'll just right click and select Paste. So, what happens after you share a file on Google Drive? Well, Google Drive has some really powerful co authoring features. For example, if we open our document, we can see that some of the other people we've shared the file with are viewing it as well. The real-time co-authoring feature allows everyone to work on the document at the same time. Everyone's changes will be indicated with a cursor by their names, so you can tell who's doing what in the document. It's also easy to leave comments to talk back and forth with one another. To insert a comment in Google Docs, just select something. Then click the button that appears on the right side of the document. This opens a comment box where you can add a short note about this part of the document. Your co-authors will then be able to respond directly to you. These features make it much easier to collaborate on a document and work out details with your co-authors in real time. Okay, now that you know the basics, you're ready to jump in and start collaborating and sharing on Google Drive. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.